two, y'all be coming with a suspect realized she ran over two people, y'all. Before we even get into any of that, nigga, it's 82 degrees in my fucking room at this moment. Look, look I, I, I'm gonna record it just so I can show y'all how hot it is in my room. So if anybody ever said I don't rock with y'all, they lying like hell. Nigga, I got these beaming ass lights on me, bro. It's hot as shit. But look, 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 I said, you know what? I had to come in and make a video anyway, but look. It's cut a hey, suspect realized she ran over two people. How the fuck she did realize she like she ran over somebody at the scene? But anyway, let's go ahead and get to the video. Welcome new subscribers, new people. Let's get into the video. Want me to be honest with you? You're going to jail. You don't have a bond. You killed two people tonight. Damn! This is Stephanie's reaction to she finding out him? she ended the lives of two innocent people oh my while God. driving. Completely oblivious to everything she did. There's no way she's oblivious. There's no fucking way. There's no way. Like, like little, there's no way. We lie. Like, but we lying. Like, we lying right now. But look at this damn. Look at this window. I Man, look. Oblivious. What the fuck? Is she blind? Nigga? The until the next morning when this happened. Did you understand what I told that you killed two people tonight? Yeah. So I'm just wondering where I can go to school. Okay. What? what? After receiving a call that a woman had hit a pedestrian with her car, they arrived minutes later to check out the scene. Bruh, ain't no way, boy. Ain't no way, boy. Ain't no way. Oh my god. I'm over here with me, man, okay? I called as soon as this shit happened. I was like, this doesn't happen. I understand. I go to Bradley. Like, why would this happen to me? Okay. Stephanie is referencing her attendance at the Bradley University of Illinois, a private school that tutors some of the smartest students in the area. But as you'll soon see, Stephanie isn't one of their star pupils. Were you leaving the bar? Were you coming this day? I was coming. I was coming here. Okay. You know, I had just gotten my night started. So. Were you going this direction yeah. or this direction? I was coming this direction. Okay. Here's what we're going to have you do. Uh, yes. Let's just get, let's get away from you. See a little bit yes. like them do their thing, okay? This is your car, right? The yes. correct? The red car, you were the only one in the vehicle. I'm the only one. Okay, come over here to my spot car, okay? Yep. Do you, can you take your purse off and just set that on here? We got it. Yep. Do you have anything illegal on you? Yes, I have marijuana in, in your purse. Okay. Have you had any marijuana tonight? No. Okay. Do you set those on the car for before? My vape too. While she hadn't been smoking that night, the cop can already tell she oh, definitely been drinking. Nigga, Just how people? much will be discovered later. Nigga, She's then taken to a patrol car and read her. Hey, yeah, yeah. Quick, quick disclaimer, nigga. Do not drink. Wait, is it TOs? TO? Right, TOs will fuck you up. Look, I got so many stories of TOs, I'm not even gonna get into it. Just look, look, look. If you ever, if you a young nigga coming up and you hit the age of 21, look, don't, don't, don't do it. I'm telling you, TOs will fuck you up. Be, look, you gotta know your limit. You got to know your limit. She didn't know her limit. She thought she could drive. Hell no. Look, if you ever, like, if you got a question if you could drive, nigga, don't drive. I mean, do not drive. Miranda do writes, drive. but drive. since she hadn't taken a sobriety test, she hadn't yet been arrested. The cop decides to question her about the evening while he tries to figure out exactly Bro, what happened. Question, were, you, were you driving this way or that coming down that side road? Here, this way. Okay. And suddenly, one person walked out in front of me. One? And what? my car got hit. I called you as soon as it got hit. You, you called 911? Yes, I called 911. And then someone said, oh, someone else has hit. I'm just like, oh my god, how did that happen? Okay, what so, happened when you hit the one person? What happened? I just called you. That's all I know. Okay. Did you. did they fall down right away, or did you get out and help them, or what happened? When they got out, I called you, and then everyone else came out, so I like kind of just let them okay. come and take over the situation. Okay. Um, but I promise you, like I only know one person got hit, and I'm just like, they came out of nowhere because I. If you had to ask me, how fast were you going when? We hit the person. 120. 120. I would say I was at least, at least 40. 40. At least at least 40. Maybe 40 or 45, but at least Shit, 40. 145. Stephanie was driving through a residential area with a speed limit of 30 miles an hour. This meant she was going at least 30% over the speed limit in the dark. It's also becoming increasingly obvious just how drunk Stephanie really is. Her speech is much more animated and exaggerated than that of a sober person. She's struggling to sit still in her chair, and she randomly gazes off into the distance, amongst other strange behavior. Obviously, you saw them. It was no time to react or try to stop. No time. Okay. That's the word. Okay. 
Over the course of the night, how much have you had to drink? I probably had about three drinks. What's what's what is three drinks? You like? Are we talking what type of drinks? Um, just one. Vodka, straight vodka, or mixed drinks? Uh, vodka had water, so I was staying hydrated, you know. And okay. like uh, right now, if you had me do a test, I think I would pass. Just like, not don't test me, but I think I would pass. Unfortunately for Stephanie, the cops have to test her given circumstances. What am I watching? What am I watching? Let's also what am I take watching? a second to what realize am I watching? that Stephanie what am I is fully aware that she's just hit two people with her car. What am I watching? But she's failing to show any concern oh, or gosh, you don't give Whether that's because of her inebriated condition or just her personality no, bro. remains to be seen. Right, no. Would you follow a tip like that? If your eyes, your eyes if you bleed, but keep you your head still, more, would you I continue think, that test? Like, I just ran over two you understand? Yeah. All right, touch the tip of my then just so you know where you... There you go. All right. That's what I want you to follow. Nope, keep your head still for me. Oh, my head. Okay. Yes, ma'am. I missed it. <laughs> Just your eyes. Damn! Oh, we're trying to do it again. It's All right. Just. Okay, okay, okay. When I say you're going to take nine heel to toe steps down this line, you're going to turn around and take nine heel to toe steps back. Uh, bro, she, bro, she's drunk, bro. Take a, come on now. If there was, if there was a black man, this shit would have been over it. Come in the car, nigga. Get in the car. Nigga, what? Bro, she just ran over two people. Continue the test, okay? Not only did Stephanie completely fail all three tests, she was also laughing and smiling throughout oh, them. Mommy, but there was still it. one final thing the cops had to do before they could bro, arrest her. Bro, In Illinois, good. you have to have a blood alcohol level of below .08 to be allowed to drive. Keep that in mind as she takes this breathalyzer test. Okay, zero, you know point what the legal limit is to drive point eight, in Illinois? Point eight, point eight. Okay, point zero eight. okay? What is he at? What I have you do is take a deep breath, a long bar steady blow into the straw, just like you're blowing up a balloon. Keep blowing until you hear the machine click, okay? All right? <laughs> yes, ma'am. Take a deep breath, long bar steady blow. Bro, she is laughing, my A little bit harder for me, a little bit harder. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. Okay. You're a point two six four. okay? You go ahead and turn around for me and place your hands down your back. You are under arrest for DUI. But the night still isn't over for Stephanie, as she's taken back to the police station, where it's becoming increasingly obvious how unremorseful and oblivious she is about the entire situation, and where the fate of the victims she's hit Damn, is revealed. <laughs> How do I get my car for this? Your car is told. That's what? Your car is told. Told, told? Total, wrecked. It's done. Okay, so how do I get You don't go to school tomorrow. You don't. So, you went to school. I don't go to school tomorrow. That's what you're saying. Yes. You're going no. to jail. You want me to be honest with you? You're going to jail. You don't have a bond. You killed two people tonight. I don't think you understand that. You do not have a bond. You are not getting out of jail. Your car is property of East Peoria Police Department because it's a crime scene. It killed two people tonight. You are clueless with that. Clearly, I've already explained this to you. You're going to jail for reckless homicide tonight. You're going to jail for aggravated DUI for killing two people. That's what's going on. So no, you're not going to school tomorrow. You're not getting your car out of inbound. What's she saying? Did you just hear what I just told you? You said I'm not going tomorrow. I'm talking about Tuesday. Did you hear what I... There's no fucking way. There's no way. There's no way. There's no way. I just... Why? Why are there people like this in the fucking world, my nigga? Look, look. I don't judge. I don't judge at all. But this shit... Like, come on, bro. Come, Bro, you just killed two people. Like, not that... Bro, bro, you ran over... Like, ran... Nick, oh, and then one person's leg was off. Nick, you was going fast as hell. They said that you. Did you? You're going to jail when they're down here. Nigga, yes. you going to jail? Did you understand what I told you? You're going to jail, people, jail, right? jail yeah, nigga. So I'm just wondering why I keep school. You won't. Yeah. You can't. You know, your own body count <laughs> being completely careless about killing two people tonight. You could care less. That's sad and pathetic. 
They're horrible all at the same time. Did you say that? Really Not only is Stephanie completely unaware of the facts that she ended the lives of two innocent people Whoa. while drunk driving, she's also oblivious to the fact that she's going to be spending a very long time in jail. Husband, why? I know most people remember embarrassing things the morning after, but this is going to be one hell of a hangover. The case was already pretty cut and dry, yeah. and Stephanie all but confessed on the body cam footage. So she decided to plead guilty to four felonies, including aggravated DUI, and to the deaths of both the victims that died that night. Wow. On the 27th of April, 2023, Stephanie discovered that she really wouldn't be going back to school anytime soon. You were all and was sentenced to 14 years. <laughs> I mean, she did. She deserved it. She. Well, that's, that's reasonable. 14? Really, really? Yeah, 14. I think. Damn, two people, husband and wife, look like maybe. Yeah, yeah. I'm sorry, bro. Look, y'all. At the end of the day, bro, your life is look. It's not. Say, say, say you drunk. Like, say you know you drunk some, and like you think, like even if you even feel like a little woozy, my nigga, call Uber, call a friend. Look, if I get drunk, nigga, hello, ring, ring, police. Ring, ring, mama. Nick, I'm not. No, there's no way in hell. Bro, you will never catch. Bro, you will never catch me driving. Hell nah. But if y'all enjoyed the video, make sure you like, comment, subscribe. And I'll see y'all next video. We out. Bye.